Hey guys, it's Kate. Of course, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you a synthetic wig. Now, I know y'all, I have not done synthetic a synthetic wig review in so long and I absolutely miss it, y'all. So, this one is for you guys who have been patiently waiting for a synthetic wig review. I promise you guys, I'm going to do more synthetic wigs. I just recently learned about myself I don't really like to wear synthetic wigs in the summertime. It just does not work for me. So I think this whole summer I have not worn a synthetic wig. To me, synthetic fibers just don't work well with heat. So that's another reason I just have not been wearing synthetic wigs lately, but I'm definitely going to get back into it. So this wig was actually sent to me by Elevate Styles, just in case any of you guys are interested. Of course, I'm going to go ahead and leave all the details in my description box. The brand this is by is Sensational. This is from the Dashley Collection. It's actually a new wig they just came out with. So I have it in a style Lace Unit 22 and she's in a color 2. So this is what the stock card looks like basically and it's a pretty simple wig and it has like a little it looks like a little spiral curl in the front i'm not sure so i'm gonna try her on with the lace still on so you can just get an idea of what of what the wig looks like straight out of the packaging and like i predicted i knew that this wig was gonna lay flat just how it looked so I'm gonna go in with my brush and it don't look like I'm gonna have to put in a lot of work when it comes to this wig. And it is a yakky texture, like a really light yakky texture. Um, it's a slight shine. The shine is kind of showing up a little bit more on camera versus in person. So the wig is not overly shiny, but it does have a shine. But it This is what the wig looks like with the lace still on, which is a pretty simple but pretty wig. I can't wait to like cut the lace off and everything, but this is what it looks like. I definitely like this side better than this side. I don't know. I just wish that they matched, but this is what the part in looks like, which it looks like I'm going to definitely have to go in with some finishing powder or concealer to make that look a little bit more natural. And this is the hairline. So if you are wondering about the sides of this cap, I do feel like it's a normal cap size. If you have a bigger size head, you should be all right because it's, it has a lot of stretch in this, um, in this cap. So I feel like you'll be fine. And if you have a smaller size head, just go ahead and adjust your straps and you should be fine. Um, So I'm actually going to pluck some hair out the front because um, I want it to look a little bit more natural than what it's looking right now, y'all. Here 
all my end results i actually really love the way this wig lays now the lace was a bit too light for my skin complexion so if you are darker than the lace you are going to have to apply your concealer finishing powder whatever you use to blend in the lace with your skin complexion so i did have to go in and add like finishing powder to blend it in with my skin because it did appear a little light i also went in and just sprayed got to be glue right here in the front i feel like sometimes when you spray got to be glue on the lace it makes the lace melt a little bit more towards the end when i brush it i do get a few snags but it's nothing terrible and i haven't got shedding from this yet but keep in mind it's a long synthetic wig so be careful how you wear it you will get tangling and shedding eventually or throughout the course of you actually wearing this wig but i actually really like it for like a every day i don't know some people if you are a fan of long hair and you're looking for a simple but cute everyday type of wig like i said if you're into long hair so if any of you guys are interested in this wig of course all the details and links to this wig will be in my description box and y'all let me know what y'all think